In this video, we're going to take a look at a tool that I designed and made for a customer. Hey there, it's Joe. So I had a customer come to me and give me this part that's used on a machine for holding this blade for cutting material. They wanted something that was thicker because this thin part right here wobbles around too much. And then they wanted something that had a quicker mechanism for changing the blade than the screw system on this part. And they wanted something similar to what this part right here has, these pins to locate the blade and the magnets to hold it down, just like that. And they need to adjust the location of this on the shaft and they've been just tapping it around and they wanted to design a system that was better for adjusting it than having to tap it on the shaft. Now they needed a right and left hand version. Now what I did is I went into my SolidWorks and reverse engineered the outside of this part by taking measurements and drawing it up. And then I made the part thicker. I incorporated the magnetic system of this part and put it on both sides. And then rather than use pins like this one does, because these pins don't fit all that great and the blade wobbles around, I milled these bosses on both sides to locate the blade to get a better fit to the blade. And then for adjustment, what I did was I designed this extra part here. And this one has a right hand thread and this has a left hand thread. And then I used this uh, screw that has a right and left hand thread. Now when you put this on the shaft, and this mechanism can be on either side of the part, put this on the shaft and you tighten down this to set it in place, then you can adjust the location and then tighten the set screw down and put your blade on and off. So that's the mechanism that I designed and hopefully you guys thought it was interesting and thanks for watching.